Hello guys, welcome to the video. Today we're going to do some more Epic 7 Guild War content. So hopefully the fights go well. We don't necessarily lose all of our units for stupid reasons. And you know, it just is good, hopefully. So enjoy the video. And here we go. Welcome back to another Guild War video. It is... Uh, I don't know what it is, but... We are against Arcadia EU2 today. Um, they are rank 30, it's Wednesday, my dudes, that's what it is. Um, we're rank 34, I'm pretty sure I just said what rank they are, but I've already forgotten, 30. Uh, we have been told in the Discord to ignore this. I'm going to shame the one person that's attacked it. There you go, that's your, your shame. Um, but we're going to attack this tower because we've been told to hit the small towers. So, here we go. So, top team looks a bit weird, but that's because it sort of is. We're going to go with Present Moon Rin, because she has her thing now for extra turn if she crits that, plus crit damage buff, into just another crit, because I've got, like, 100% crit. Uh, into Pavel sweeping both the DPSs and then being able to push forwards and kill the Edward, ideally. Uh, he does still need more attack, but he's sort of fine as he is. We might try and upgrade him again at some point if we can. And Rowana for, like, the extra stuff. Like, I could put Sid here, but it's either going to be Landy will be too fast for Sid to get past and we'll lose, or Landy will be bulky enough through being stealthed for me to not be able to kill with these two, but either way we lose if we like think that negatively so i'm just gonna go with this because at least with rowana as long as i go first on uh rin we actually get to do something with rowana whereas with sid we have a chance of losing um yeah just making sure they don't have a debuff on it for in case i aoe edward and the bottom team we're going to use our own edward to uh, tank the Karina. That's an M. Uh, the idea is I'm going to get punched by Karina after Zahak kills himself. And Edward should hopefully remove the defense break that he gets given, survive 18k damage, and be able to like do stuff afterwards. And then we can like, you know, just have stuff. Uh, Alencia for cleanup might be okay, but I guess we'll soon find out. And Celine, so we can kill Zahak as soon as he does like an on combat skill into whatever, into whatever. And then we just pray that it works. So. Let's find out. Yeah, Guiding Light, I fucking knew it. Right, so this is the extra turn no debuff. We'll hit. Actually, we'll hit her with it because it gives us the, the buff that she has, right? Oh, don't give us the extra turn, never mind. Well, that's fine. We'll hit her with this. Eh. Right. Uh, stinky Finky. Do we... She can't crit. If we push her back, that's cool. I don't know what Edit go for. You know, let's just do this and do the cooldowns. Fuck it, it'll be fine. This is why we should have brought Sid, though. Weakness is unforgivable. We did just one turn cooldown Ed, right? Yeah. We didn't Landy. I think we kill Landy, leave Ed alive, let Ed do his thing, and then hopefully rotate around and kill him. No. No, 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 we don't do that. Um, I really don't want Landy to one-shot me, but... So here's the problem that we have, right? That can stun, and I've got a thing on it, so if I hit Edward with it, I'm going to get countered. So I'm going to get AoE away. So... I need to kill Ed here. I don't care about things like honor. If I don't kill Ed here, I get AoE'd by... I, only have I get single targeted by Ed, then AoE by Ed. 
I have much to lose. Yeah, okay, we, we're fine anyway. Yeah. And I'm worrying about that too much, but... Like, if I give Edward the chance to win, he probably will. So let's, uh, let's not do that. Right, thanks. You're dead. <laughs> Wait, I guess I get a turn again. Um, I want to hit Karina, but she has got the defense buff, so I'm a little bit worried about hitting her. Hmm. I'll go for Kekwick. How much damage do to Kekwick? He's not got a defense buff, so. Yeah, that nearly killed him. Yeah, like literally there's no damage. Karina's completely fucking worthless. That's the thing, like I'm worrying about Karina too much because when she first came out, she was like big dick DPS, but now she does literally nothing. Like she's quite literally the worst unit in the entire game. Like, nobody fucking builds her for damage anymore now. So whenever she punches back at you with a defense buff, it does no damage. It's been, like, ages since I've seen a, a strong Karina. Like, it's actually weird how... how poorly people are treating her. Like, I don't use mine, like, at all. But, I don't know. People just don't seem to want to build her anymore, I guess. Or maybe I'm just, like, understanding her wrong. But... I'm like almost certain the idea for Karina is that she's supposed to see one of her friends nearly die, push all the way forwards, punch the next thing that's going to be a problem with skill 3, detonate it, detonate the rest of the enemy team, win. But no Karinas do that anymore. Like, it's so weird. But anyway, one down, two to go. Second fight, we're going to hit this tower. The only unit we're looking at now is Nakwal because everything else is staying the same. So there's Nakwal, Andre's crossbow, 269 speed, pray that she's fast enough, and then we just go in and see if we win. There's no point showing the rest of them off because we just saw them in the last fight, so. So burn this, hit everything because we've got the accuracy increase from the thing. Crossbow. Oh, never mind. First time we've missed that, like, ever, which is a bit annoying. Um, well, she can't do anything anymore, so we just steal her. We resisted. Cool. So we're lost. But we're just dead. That's it. Uh, push back. We haven't lost, but, you know, it's just... One of those, isn't it? And then blow her up. Goodbye. Well, maybe not goodbye, but close enough. Accept your fate. Oop. Done. Easy, right? That's just that's just how easy that is. I have no more business well, yeah, of course it's an injury shoe. I mean, to be fair, bringing Alencia was a bad idea here, but I was hoping, yeah, we'd get that first before shoe moved. That did no damage. It's probably ain't gonna work then, considering she's proof of valor shoe as well. Yeah. She's healing way too much. For what it's worth, she's healing way too much. Like, she should not be getting this much healing back. See, that's what I'm expecting from Karina, but she just doesn't do it to anything other than, like, just then. We're gonna have to yield this one, though, because we definitely can't win. Like, the fact that I've not even slightly killed the shoe yet is, like, a massive cause for concern. If 
If he had golden rows. I think we still could be okay. Ah, oh, fuck, she's got the truck. Hey you, watch out. Um Victory is within our grasp. Do I look like a pushover to you? Annoying common must Um Um, thank you for helping me. I yielded that fight four times. I gave up on that fight like three to four times. I was sat there like ready to close the the, the entire fight off like three to four times. I was like, maybe it'll be all right. Maybe I will live. It'll be all right. Maybe Alencia will live. It'll be all right. Maybe I can still win this. Lo and behold, we won. And we didn't lose anyone. So that's um not the way I expected that to go. So that's a, that's a, a good outcome, I guess. Jesus. So yeah, two down, one to go. Wonderful. Final fight of the Guild War. We're going to hit this tower. So, we're going to change our teams up. We're going to do the thing that I am pretty sure I said I'm never going to do again, but we're doing it anyway. Of Abigail, Benimaru, Kwazu for the top team. Like, realistically, it should be fine. I'm trying to remember why I said I don't want to do this anymore. Like, I know she can double up in between my combo. But if she doubles up in between a combo, it's not a problem. I swear there was something that happened with this before where she doubled up in between and killed Benny and it was a problem. Maybe it's just because I didn't have Abigail left. Maybe she died in a guild war and I tried it and it was like, oh yeah, so we can't do that anymore. But as long as she's there, it should be fine. And that was Quasu. And the bottom team, we're just going to run this and pray that we're... Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do versus the bottom team. Yeah, I'm going to do the other the other thing versus the bottom team, actually. I'm not going to do this. Because that works, but I do not trust... Um, yeah, I do not trust the Rowana to see enough counterattacks for it to be worth the, the uh, attempt. You better still be geared. You're missing a weapon. Uh, give me like the best HP weapon you've got that isn't in use. Oh boy, there's too many of them. That one. There we go. That'll do. Yeah, we're gonna run this team instead. So Astromancer Elena, her stats don't matter. She's just here for for that. Um. Tywin, because he protects the back line. I will double check that. I'm sure he does the uh, back row. Yeah. So they do their bullshit. Ken gets stunned. He's no longer stunned. He gets to counter attack. He kicks her in the mouth, kicks her in the mouth, kicks her in the mouth, and then we win. And they can't counter attack during any downtime stuff. So they get one attack each. And that should be fine. Bridge. Um. I maybe make a mistake doing it like this, but we're doing it like this now, so... Uh, did I show Ken? I'm sure I did, but if I didn't, here he is. Kenneth. There we go. I'm gonna guess I'll show Tywin again, because I went straight into his skills, didn't I? There you go. Tywin's just on random bulky gear to not die immediately. And Ken should be able to solo this. It should be fine. Right, let's see how badly I've just messed up. Oh, maybe... Well, no, it's not Snow Crystal, but maybe Snow Crystal's part of the reason why I don't like it. And if I double miss the crit, then I just lose. I'm glad she's got Nostalgic Music Box, and that stops me from killing the shoe, but, you know, whatever, right? I swear they've buffed that, because she never used to be able to do that ever, and then, like, after five months of me doing it, she's managed to finally do it, like, three times in quick succession. 
Yeah, we missed the thing. That might be why, then. It might be Crystal that made me not want to do this anymore. We've not been AoE'd yet, but Shu can't die anywhere. That's hard. Go for this. So... Because hitting Shu, I'm going to miss anywhere. But hitting her, we can actually hit her. It didn't do any damage. That's fine. We're still okay. Might as well push in front here. Um, oh, she's still... Oh, yeah, she's still cast. Bye. <laughs> well, see you later, Senya. What do you mean that didn't kill? Hold on. Excuse me. What type of Zaza are you fucking chatting? That, there is no way she lived that. Hold on. I was expecting the band detonate to kill her, I'll be honest. But I guess band detonates don't count for... That was not a lot of damage. I guess band detonates don't count for... Thanks for the stun. For... Cast damage. Which I don't think I knew, so I guess that's good to know. I just sort of assumed it would. I'm, I'm more shocked that Quasu just didn't do damage, honestly, to just kill her in, like, outright. Realistically. I would have thought that that would have been enough, but... What do you mean, resistance? What? I brought Tywin specifically to, to deal with that. What do you mean, resistance? Dog shit. It's an injury rebellion as well, of course it is. Yeah, we should have brought Rowana. Also, Ken Ken got taunted, by the way. Just want to throw that out there. Ken got taunted. Also, we can't stop him counter-attacking anymore because I, Elena got taunted. Fucking so dog shit, dude. Hey, she's dead. She's provoked. All right. I'm always ready. Um, she's Elvis Ritual Sword. So she can't counter me. <laughs> so she's dead anyway. So it's fine. Right, here we go. Thanks, Elena. Did Elena do anything? No, not really. But you know, she's here. I guess. I hate boring fights. Right. Are you have you got stun? Yeah, alright. You've got one one more chance. Go on. No, Ken! Why would you crit her there? there is no place you piece of shit. She had one more chance to stun. Die. You should have let her take it. What the fuck, dude? That's mean. Ah, oh, Jesus. Like I want to say Tywin wasn't even worth... Like, Ken soloed that, essentially. Like, Ken didn't need any assistance. But the defense break from Tywin does help. So, I suppose he did something. I mean, Elena helped, right? I think an Elvis Ritual Sword popped off before she lost her ability to stop them countering. So, I'm, I'm sure it was useful. Yeah, because it's when Tywin did his thing. But anyway, that's all for the video. So, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the Guild War fights. It went a lot better for, me, for us than I expected it to, to be honest. But, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I shall see you in the next Guild War.